When adding a music track to a voice recording in Audacity, your first job is to find a piece of copyright released music. It should be at least 10 seconds longer than your recording. Open your voice recording in Audacity. If it's not already saved as an Audacity project, do that now. Import the music file by using File, Import, Audio. It will appear beneath the voice track. As you can hear, the music is much louder than the voice right now, so I'm going to reduce the volume. Now let's trim the length of the music. Plan for about 5 to 10 seconds of music before and after the voice begins. I've already scoped this out, so I know what I want to cut. I will use the selection tool to pick a piece at the beginning to remove, and then press delete. I'll do the same at the end. To avoid problems later, let's insert some silence at the beginning of the voice track. Click in that track and rewind to the beginning. Next, go to Generate, Silence, and choose 3 seconds. Use the Time Shift tool to move the voice segment to where you would like it to begin. You'll probably want the music to fade in at the beginning and out at the end. Let's select part of the music track at the end and use the Effects menu to apply a fade. Now let's use the Envelope tool to reduce the volume as the voice begins. I'll insert one point where I want the volume drop to start and another immediately after. Drag the second point down to reduce the volume. I could bring the volume back up at the end, but I'm choosing not to. To test your work, press the Rewind button and then play. On Friday, why not float over to the Flanagan Flannel Fleet? Fly to the dance floor in your favorite fluffy fleece and dance flamenco until you flop. Fill up for free on flaky flapjacks and flavorful fluids. Flaunt your flashy flip-flops or flaming flats in our fabulous footwear contest. This Friday, flirt with your secret flame at the Flanagan Flannel Fleet. 